Welcome to my relocation vlog. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Take a seat. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, welcome to my relocation vlog. I think shooting is 0.5 is so nice. I like it. Anyway, I'm getting my cast this week or next week latest. So in like a month from now, I should be there or getting ready to leave. <sighs> Hi. Um, good morning. So two days after the first video. I got my class. Um, I'm currently applying for my student visa. I started yesterday, I should finish today or tomorrow, I don't know. But yeah, I'm applying this week and hopefully this week or next week they get back to me as well. So, so I just left the exam. I am submitting to the exam. It was actually really fast. I got here by 7 40 and this is 8 30. It was fast, so. Hi guys. It's been a while. Last time I, I was here was like. Okay, today is 12 days since I dropped my my passport, so. And I've been sick. I feel sick. There's something with my lip. I don't know what it is. But it's not painful, it's just there. Um, so today is the 12th day. Um, they said it is, takes three weeks, so that's about 15 working days. I think I've actually not even shared like the agency I used and everything. So, I, okay, when I get home, I think I shouldn't do this on the road. Okay, I'll see you tomorrow. Hi guys, so I just got back from church, and so I just wanted to talk about the agency that I use or that I'm currently using for my home education process so I use IDP and this is not a paid anything it's just it really doesn't cost anything straight for me right now so I used IDP Nigeria I found them when I went to write my IELTS it's not as if the school I, I wanted to apply to required it I just wanted to have it so I just made inquiries of their services and they said it was free so I was like yeah sure why not and I think one of the things I really like about their services is the fact that it's free. Number two, um, is because it's the fact that they used my email for everything that pertains to me. Do you understand? It wasn't as if I was always reaching out to them to ask for updates. They were the ones reaching out to me to ask about updates because they used my personal email. So I think it, it just allows me to be up to date on everything that pertains to like the admission and the application and everything. So. Um, all I did was just give them my documents, the documents they asked of me, and they helped with everything, everything from applications to the university and the visa application, everything. Uh, they also helped me prepare for my class interview. Yeah. What else did I want to talk about? First of all, cheers, having Arbina. Anyway. So I don't really, because I didn't do everything myself, I will not really come here to give you advice and everything like that because I really don't know. Which I'll see them, they have an office in Ikeja, GRA, that's where I went to. And maybe Instagram or their website as well, I don't know. But I'll just tag them in my description box so that you, you know what you're looking for. Um, yeah, so if, what I have left to do right now is um, I need to buy more like long sleeve tops okay i think the only advice i can give i think the only advice i can give is to know your style before you leave and like have a pinterest board i've always had a pinterest board this is like i think 400 500 where i've just always saved things that i like and so earlier this year i started saving things for like the season i know that i will be resuming so now i think the are turning towards winter now because it's getting really cold so i already have a pinterest board so that way i know the things i can get from nigeria like jeans um sweaters and i know when i get there i'm just going to buy like the outerwears the puff 
fudge and get some stuff like that. So, so far, I've only gotten, I got two more pair, pair of jeans, pairs of jeans, two more jeans and one more pair of trousers. So, I have like five bottoms that I know for sure that I'm taking along because the other ones are skinny. So, I don't know if I'm taking them along, it's just extra long because I won't wear it out. My hair is due. And I won't, I'm going to lock my hair. I'm not going to make braids because I'm hoping that the four locks will take me for like three months. We, we probably know that I won't take the hair for three months, but I can try at least maybe two months. So I'm going to get like one more wig to take along with me. So, also, um, I don't think I've come here to talk about my own. I'm so happy about this award. Last year when I nominated myself, I didn't win. This year they nominated me and I won. I don't know, everything is timing to be honest. Like, I'm not coming and come and preach to you, but maybe I wouldn't have really valued the award if I won that time. Because it would just be like a moment of show of like, I was still setting it up to a year and I won an award. But now I think it just means a lot more to me because I know how much work that I put into study statistics and it did. The award just came at the most perfect time, you know. I didn't attend physically but um, I watched it live and my rider helped me to, um, go to the office to pick up the award so I'll be back again. I've registered my courses. I to mention what I'm studying. So I'm studying I'll be studying I was about to say information on computer engineering. That's what I studied for my undergraduate. I'll be studying artificial intelligence, MSc artificial intelligence at the University of Wolverhampton. I will take them. I love being a tech girl. It makes me happy. It gets me very excited. I love talking about my job. I just love it. I don't know. But yeah, um, so I'll be back again this week for sure. For sure, by God's grace, to come and tell you that I'm going to become my first Hi guys, good morning. Today is my last Sunday in church. I'm going for first and second service because the teens are ministering in the big church so I have to assist in like the coordination and stuff. So, I'm happy. I've still not gotten the, the email to come and pick up my passport but this week, by God's grace, in Jesus name, um, I think my hair looks better than last time you guys saw it. I'm hoping. I think so. I didn't comb it. I just used my fingers this time around. Bye. Hi guys. Good morning. So, um. I got my passport on Friday and I just couldn't film on Friday because I was really tired and I had to come back home to work and yesterday was really busy for me because I made my hair, I did four locks, I used two and a half packs of four locks, they told me, the problem is they told me, um, I'll, I'll put like the, this thing but on their description they said that it's 13 in a pack so my calculation was if i buy five packs that's about 65 quarts right and then i bought it and it was like 20 something in one pack so i ended up using like two and a half so yeah the hair is really nice it doesn't even look that sure i like it so i want to start packing now i'll iron a few of my clothes that need ironing because i got that laundry nylon so that's how i'm going to pack my things um I'm not sure when I'll be leaving, but let's just do T minus five. So if it changes, then you know. But for now, I think I'll just say T minus five. Buy my toiletries and skincare. That's how from that. That's all. I think this hair was probably like the most important part for me because I didn't want to make braids. I didn't know if I'll have time doing it to um to go and do it. So yeah, that's the updates. I'm very happy. I'm very happy. I'm going yeah. So, pack with me, I think, I guess. I think that's what I would say. Wait, how are you guys doing? This is like my 
fourth week of being inactive on Instagram, a few people have chatted to me and I think it's just really sweet that they have because I didn't think they knew it was my absence really. I don't know why I said that. But hey guys, good morning. Would you believe that after that last video before this, my phone fell and it went blank. I, I don't know. I should have fell down from my tripod and it went blank. I'm not carrying that tripod, right? Hi guys, good morning. Um I'm finally leaving tomorrow and I'm just about to start packing. I'm very nervous. I have a butterfly in my tummy. I'm excited but like just I think the whole thing is just hitting now because even when I got my passport I was still not feeling it. But um yeah I just have to pack now and still do like the final batch of laundry because I'm taking this stuff along and I got one sweater like that so I just want to wash that. I made my nails. I made my hair. Oh, I think you guys already saw that. Uh, so, yeah, that's pretty much. I'm going to pack. Yesterday, I got my skincare and like snacks to take along for my family. Uh, so yeah, that's pretty much. I'm going to show you guys how I packed my things. I I packed according to colors. Even my wardrobe. If you, I think one of my vlogs I said something like that. So I packed. Um, by colors so i'm very happy with i'm just very nervous i'm going to miss my my parents i'm going to miss my friends my family but i won't cry what am i going for my parents most likely cry but me i beg i beg um let's go let's go let's go that's my word by the way so this or like how I arranged I think this this has like two bottoms two bottoms black black I think this is one sweater and I think there's a gray sweater here I think these are like my blue I didn't have that much blue items to be honest so um I think two blue jeans here one blue jeans and I think like two jeans skirts a sweater a shirt and blues green then this is like my nightwear pink my towel and then this has like all my whites um my pants it has a skirt there's this really cute skirt i go i've never worn it before this has like two blazers i don't know if i'll need them but yeah i didn't really take like tops i'm just going to get most of my things when i get there so let's get to packing i got toothbrush mouth wash dental floss i already had this one at home i got it from sheen then just a few things um let me care and then for my hair because i have full locks now i already have this one at home so i just got all sheen oil my edge control wax and stuff like that and then my body care this is i already have this at home so i just got this 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 i already have this and this and my makeup i just washed my brush this is a brow gel this is a mascara from zara i got this tiny micellar water yesterday and then I already have this foundation. I don't know. This is I got it for one five. Hopefully it does the work. I may not even really be wearing makeup like that, but I already have this. I've had this powder palette since God knows when. And I don't use makeup all the time. I got this lip gloss from Zaron yesterday and it's so thick. Like really thick. So that's all for my this thing. So I'm gonna spark them now. Hi guys, so I just finished. I'm like 90% done packing. I fully packed my bags that I'm traveling. I don't know what I'm saying. I've packed the bags that I'm taking along with me. So now I'm just clearing my room, clearing out everything in this room. It's this room so much. So um, I have stress people. I'm so tired. Really, I'm very tired. So what I'm going to do now is just clear my bed and just arrange all over again remove add remove add and then i'm done and then i'm ready Bye.
and I'm going to get my boxes now and I'm so like my ears hurt me that's all that I can see right now I'm so hungry though am I hungry I'm happy also I didn't cry I expected to cry the tears were forming but they didn't come out I don't know okay bye okay so I got to see yesterday like 9 o'clock so i was just really tired that's why i didn't do anything i just went to be okay no i just ate and then i went to sleep so i think i'll just end the vlog here all i did today all i did today was i mean all i'll be doing today is to just settle like sort out my residence permit and run my courses i already did that one and i think I, I don't know if i need to do physically as well i really don't know i'll be going to school i have lectures today but i won't be doing that because i need to settle in so i would start my lectures on tuesday and also was it because of flowers <laughs> i was so shy i was so shy when i was getting up when i was going to see who do you do this to me do this to me but yeah my flowers are so pretty and they're green this small um thank you guys for watching this video. I hope that it was eventful. I couldn't even take any, any pictures at the airport. I mean I need things to do, my dad asked me to do it for like okay, I'm talking. So I'll see you in my next vlog. Obviously I would post more for now because it's just be like weekly vlogs and I, I won't be doing as much. I mean I'm still working there. Anyway. Thank you guys for coming to the world. Flowers for you too, for watching for me.